Hi, nice that you're watching the promotional video for the International School of Business, part of the Han University of Applied Science, in Dutch, the Hogeschool Arnhem Nijmegen. My name is Rob Warmehoven. My name is Oliver. In this video, we're going to give you some inside information on the international business program that has been offered at the International School of Business. Why should you choose international business? The international business world is always changing. Tomorrow will be different than today. So companies continuously adapt to this new environment. What we try to do, we try to prepare you for this business environment. If you like to study sales figures, market data, sell products throughout the world, if you like to study business processes, to see what are the strengths and weaknesses of companies, and to write a recommendation how companies can improve their situation. If you would like to solve organizational problems, like to find opinions, do market research, this course might be very interesting for you. You step right into a dynamic, fast-paced world where no day is the same. A typical classroom has about 25 students and me. We choose for this setup because we strongly believe that interaction between students and interaction between students and lecture is the best way to learn. You can always raise questions if something is not clear, ask extra examples, or I can check if something is clear by asking you questions. And in this dynamic interaction, magic happens, you learn. Besides classrooms of 25 students, we also use project groups. Together with four or five other students, you work in small groups. For example, in the first year, we have project day. One day a week, we give you an assignment in the morning, we explain what we expect, and then you have three, four hours to come up with a solution for the problem that we have described. And in this way, you'll learn in a practical way new skills, new attitudes, and you gain new knowledge. Besides small project groups, besides lectures in a small classroom, max 25 students, we also have individual student support. It might be tough the first year, a new environment, new students, new courses, it might be overwhelming, but there is a coach for you. Once, twice per semester, you will meet with your coach. You discuss grades, you discuss your well-being, you discuss all kinds of things that matter for you and that might influence your study success here at the Han. He or she will help you in making sure that you have the right course program, that you feel here at home. And in year three and year four, when you're not here at school, when you do your placement or you study abroad, there's still coaches for you available. So you're, there's always someone who you can ask questions to. This is year one. You see a lot of courses that sounds very familiar, marketing, finance, statistics, research. We also have intercultural management. In a normal class, you will have around 12 different nationalities. We have students from China, from Brazil, from Spain, Italy, Russia, and of course the Netherlands. And working together might be sometimes difficult, but we try to somehow teach you how to work together in a very international group. So you need these skills. So we train you already in year one. We have courses in online marketing and statistics, all preparing you to make a decision in year two about what specialization you're going to choose. How will a normal day look like? Well, you start at nine o'clock till 10.30, you have two hours of marketing. You have a coffee break, you walk together with your classmates to another room to have a three-hour finance class. 
lunch break, and you finish the day with English, business communication. The next day, project day. The other day, something else. Every day you have different courses, interesting subjects, challenges that you have to face, but at the end of the week, you have learned so much. After finishing your first year, you will be welcomed into the second year. In this year, you are going to uh, follow general or modules for all students, but also you're going to choose modules for your specialization. So here you have to remember three things. The first thing is you have, uh, let's say, the so-called C cluster with the general modules based on various specialization, but meant for all students. And in the D cluster, you will form modules that are actually meant for the specialization that you have chosen. So have you chosen for supply chain management? Have you chosen for organization and change? Have you chosen for finance and control? Or have you chosen for marketing and sales? Based on your choice, you will get to study specific modules. And we will also give you the opportunity to broaden your knowledge by following some uh, modules that we call electives. So this could be a module like uh, things like a blockchain technology or circular economy. And so these is, are just there for you to broaden your knowledge. And we are very proud that we have lots of these modules that will help you to broaden the knowledge that you have. Um, after finishing the um, second year, you will go abroad. So for a year, we want to see you at the International School of Business because you will go and experience a different culture or two different cultures. So you go abroad to do your internship or you can go and do a study abroad at one of the very many partner universities that we have. Uh, this is for us, it's a way to give you the opportunity to satisfy one of our principles, which is the three culture principle, in which we look at your culture. So if you come from abroad, you are here, that means the Dutch culture will be your second culture, and then you have to go abroad for your either internship or for your study abroad. If you're Dutch, you have to go twice abroad, so you have these three different cultures. Yeah. And as uh, you uh, may have heard from my colleagues, that in the first year, we work in small groups, and in these groups, they are, they are as diverse as possible, uh, which means we simulate the internationalization at home by making sure you have different people from different cultures in your group. And you also have the opportunity and you definitely have to also follow some modules which are French, German, Dutch or Spanish. Dutch is actually meant for students that are not um, Dutch students. So this will then complete our internationalization at home uh, principle. Uh, after you come back from abroad, you will get into the fourth year. Here you will proceed with your specialization in modules. So you go much more deeper into modules that have to do with the chosen specialization. And you also be working on your research skills. This will be done within the uh, International School of Business. And um, after that, you will do the graduation internship, which is actually the point where you're going to prove to the companies and to the school that you're actually prepared to go and start up your job as a starting professional. And this, you will do um, this kind of graduation internships at companies. It could be within the Netherlands, but it could also be um, abroad. So you do the real work experience to prove what you are able to do. Um, so to wrap up, once you have done all these specializations, I think it's good for you to realize to say what could be the career opportunities that are there for you. So if you have chosen for a financial control, then you can uh, think of yourself becoming a financial controller of a financial manager. And if you choose things like supply chain management, think about being the purchasing manager or somebody who's going to be the operations manager of, of a firm. So, but all these 
are possibilities in terms of careers. You can become a marketing specialist. You can become a sales manager. You can also become like a management consultant uh, where you're going to be advising companies on how to run their businesses. Some people can, of course, choose to go and get a master's degree. Yeah? But what do you have to have in terms of qualifications to join us? So actually, you need a secondary school diploma uh, whereby um, you are allowed for the uh, Dutch people, we can say VAO, HAVO, MBO4, and uh, for others, it's important that you make sure that you have the right uh, diplomas, I can, as you can see on these slides. And if your English um, is in that, uh, at the level that we think it has to be, then you have to do a TOEFL test or an hours test, uh, at least for all international students, so that you can join our classes. Let me tell you one more thing, which is very important also when you're studying, is that you can join our business community where lots and lots of things are organized, trips abroad, and they're getting people to tell us the stories, organizing get-togethers. So it will be really a place for you to mix with all people and just become one of them. But you can also enjoy our city of Arnhem, which is really a very beautiful place to be. So hopefully, we're gonna see you back here at International School of Business.